Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Come back. No, I'm just playing. Hey man, what it is, what it do, man. It's your homie, it's your main man, Bill to Go, man. If you are new to this channel, hi, my name is Bill to Go. All I do is do reactions, shoe uh, shoe vlogs, shoes and vlogs, shoe vlogs, whatever you want to call them. I don't care. It, hey, I like shoes and all this other shit. But we're gonna go ahead and get right into the video, man. Uh YBN Corday. How you pronounce that name? Corday? Is it Corday? Corda? I don't know. But it's called old niggas. You know what I'm saying? Uh, a J. Cole response. I really want to see this shit. I really want to hear it, man. Uh, it came out, I want to say yesterday or two days ago. It's one of those two. But I really want to see what he has to say. Because, you know, J. Cole, one of my favorite artists. YBN, I, you know, it's YBN. You know what I'm saying? I'm expecting that, that Bay Area shit. You know what I'm saying? But I heard he's a nice rapper. You know what I'm saying? Some shit that you wouldn't even expect from, you know, young kids. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but let's let's go ahead and get right into the video, man. If you guys like the video, man, please like, share, comment, subscribe, man. Show it to your friends, man. Maybe they'll fuck with the channel. I don't know, man. But YBN Day, old niggas, J. Cole 1985 response. It's a music video. Just came out with this shit, man. We gonna go ahead and listen to this. Look, I ain't even gonna lie. Okay, start off simple. You know, looking at shit, we, we just getting a depiction. He looking at all this shit. Everybody keeps saying he said about Lil Pump this, Lil Pump that. You know, Lil Pump beat came out with a, uh, some shit. He was playing around with J. Cole saying, fuck J. Cole. That was an actual song. Didn't really say shit on the song, but he said some shit. Lil Pump called it. Now look, look. He gets you geeked and shit. You know what I'm saying? I fuck with Lil Pump. I fuck with J. Cole more, though. You know what I'm saying? He just came out with KOD. How do you guys feel about KOD? You know, it's been out for, um, what, like a month already? How you guys feel about KOD? Let me know what's your favorite song in the comment section below. But, you know, coming from, you know, just, I know everybody probably know. It's, it's you know, J. Cole, Lil Punk. You know what I'm saying? Cole, knowing he gonna spit 1985 and all this other shit. But let's, uh, let's, let's, let's Old niggas and new niggas, now what's the difference? All in the same boat, in the stuck position. So when the old niggas talking, I don't fucking listen. They don't know every day we make tough decisions. It seems though we is at a generational gap. Which bring conversation in the statement, in fact. We can't agree, none of us is supposed to make it a rap. I understand both sides, let me break it in half. Let's mm. Mm. Hold on, young nigga. Hold on. I look, I don't know what to put myself in the category of of a old a, a old hip hop head or a new hip hop head, but to me, you know, I was born with the old hip hop, but you know, I'm more into the new hip hop and all this other shit. But hey, from this part right here, the the, the shit that he talking right now, you know what I'm saying, the decision that we making shit, and man, it's life is getting tough out here. I swear to God. I know it was tough back in the day and all that shit, but man, right now this shit fucking tough, bro. I ain't gonna lie. The situations you get put into, and you ain't even supposed to be in a fucking situation. Take it back when hip hop originated, and old niggas said it was whack, they couldn't take it, and called it a little trend set, and wouldn't last. Now it's the number one genre as the time passed. I'm glad he got dog. I'm, I'm loving the whole whole scene that he got barbershop talk, bro. Like, that, that's what niggas talking about now. And. Niggas would go get trimmed up and all that shit, man. I know I got the same shot on from the last video. If you guys like the last video, go watch the last video. Like that shit, blah, blah, blah. Um, man, I know niggas would be talking about this shit, man. Like, man, how you like that YBN core that... Bro, the nigga, I ain't gonna lie, bro. The nigga can spit, bro, for real. Young niggas won't listen and we know it. But old niggas always talking, never show it. You gotta practice what you preach and the classes that you teach will eventually listen. My mind mentally prison. Uh, lately, all my idols, they been failing me. Catch a sexual assault and some felonies. Ah! I mean, catch it with a sexual assault and some felonies. 
Who are you talking about? Please let me know in the comment section below. Who are you talking about with sexual assault cases and shit? Do you want me to listen what you telling me? And want to hate when we sing our little melodies? And other idols, they be broke. Get your funds in order. And Kanye West is a Trump supporter. Then we got R. Kelly and Bill Cosby, who still probably got little girls in the Hills lobby. There we go. That's who we talking about. I knew he had to be talking about one of them two niggas. You know what I'm saying? Um, that was y'all idols, my nigga? It was some good items until all this shit happened, man. He's supposed to be our heroes, Negro, please. Oh, niggas are reliable like D-Rose knees. Only man that... Mmm. Mmm. You didn't have to bring D-Rose into this, bro. Oh, God, bro. What did D-Rose do to you, bro? Damn, niggas unreliable like that, my nigga. I mean, his knees been reliable this season. You know what I'm saying? He been balling off the bench, bro. He been balling for Minnesota, man. You gotta give him props. He was all right with Cleveland, but you know he got more shine in Minnesota and shit, bro. But come on, bro, really? D Rose knees. Trust is G O D. Not to mention most deaf and Talib Kweli. Now I get it, y'all think new niggas really suck and white kids fucking love it, little silly ducks. But I know it's a lot of bullshit going on. I understand. But please don't complain without a plan. Ironically, I wrote this whole song off of Zan. Now I'm playing. I'm just trying to be a fucking man. We see. He gotta bring that up into the situation because niggas be on that shit for real, bro. And I know that nigga heat beep. Look. He gonna go crazy. He gonna go crazy. I give him a year, bro. I give him a year, folks. I give him a year, bro. I swear to God, if dog don't make it, bro, y'all niggas trash for not even recognizing this nigga, bro. He gonna go crazy. I don't know how old he is. He probably like 17, 18 at the most. You know what I'm saying? 19 at the latest. But he gonna go crazy. You old niggas, there's a lot of clowns. Not to mention our father figures was not around. So we all on tours and we hop in towns. We just need to sit down and find common ground. And it's soon to come, soon to come. Hip hop need battles like the moon and sun. It feels good when I wear Christian Louboutins. So I gotta drop music to accrue some funds. And I. Mmm. Gotta drop music just to accrue the funds. Man. Where did you, where did you come from? You know what I'm saying? You in YBN, I would, like, I know you probably cool with your niggas and shit, bro. But where did you come from out of all people? Like, yo rap and, and, you know, YBN The Mirror and YBN Almighty J, them niggas are separate from what you do, bro. So where did you come from with this shit? You just came out with two songs, bro. Where are you coming from? That's the mindset that's killing the rhyme fest for feeding our families. Long run the crime, yet you want us to be separate and make a contest. Rapping is saying about the streets, shutting mind that. Staying out of prison, that we saying fuck the system, man. Rapping is our outlet to go and get our dividends. Rather than out robbing niggas, selling where they lay. Old niggas bitter, y'all should love it when a nigga win. Hey, from the same Bitter, y'all should love when a nigga win. Folks are spitting hot fucking. Fire! Fire! Go like Diddy and Dane Russell was teaching the game hustle. Got rich from Main Subtle. See, I listen. See, I listen. But Lord, there they want a whipping in the kitchen. Run to flip a pack and bring it back. No submission. Gotta just go attack. Little pumped when you're dissing. I understand. Gotta go back. What a weapon in the kitchen. Run to flip a pack and bring it back. No submission. Gotta just go attack. Little pump when you're dissing. I understand both sides of the ziplock. Your old niggas time is coming, nigga. Tick tock. I'ma still wear all my Gucci flip flops. And the fucking diamond chain with the big rocks. And I be the greatest ever, nigga. Just watch. Cardi B got rich from love and hip hop. <laughs> Damn. Look, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Dog killed it, bro. Like, no no jack, bro. He murdered this shit. And he's saying, basically, man, my camera about to die. I'm gonna hurry up. But basically, he explaining himself, like, I'm a young dude. I don't care what I wear as long as I still got my same state of mind. And, I mean, it's a trend. It's it's, it's gonna continue, man. It's, it's You know what I'm saying? You gonna live your lifestyle, let me live my lifestyle. You can't talk shit about the next nigga, but you ain't worried about yourself. You know what I'm saying? And coming from both perspectives, I can understand where J. Cole is coming from, and I can understand where YBN Cordae coming from. 
the shit fire. Man, but let me know how y'all respond to this. Let me explain to me what he talking about, man. I want to know everybody else's opinion and how y'all feel about this YB and Corday dog. He look, two songs already dropped. One is a response, you know, the next one is just uh, Eminem, you know what I'm saying? Like I, I look, he left me speechless. I ain't gonna lie. The man nice. He got that shit. But if you guys like the video, man, please like, share, comment, subscribe. And like I said, Please, let me know about YB and Corday. Do you guys feel this nigga what he talking about? Or is he talking that bullshit? Let me know in the comment section below, man. I would like to hear it, man. I would like to get other people's opinions. To people that's new, man. Uh, share it with your friends, man. Subscribe if you guys are watching. If you guys aren't subscribed, man, please subscribe, man. I'm trying to get to 200, man. You know what I'm saying? Um, it's your boy. It's your main man, Bill to go. And I'm out. Gang!